Hello everyone, welcome to Home Cooking with me Hima Subramanian. Cauliflower has a great adaptability and hence we can use it for any dish we want. Today I'm going to show you all a nice starter recipe which is both sweet and savory in taste. It's called Honey Garlic Cauliflower and it's going to taste amazing. So let's get started and check out the recipe. I've taken one head of cauliflower, cut it into florets, medium sized florets. Just pour enough hot water and let this sit for about 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, strain the cauliflowerets and cool it completely. Now I'm going to make a batter. I've taken half cup of maida that is all purpose flour. Next, add 2 tablespoons of corn flour. To this I'm going to add 1 teaspoon of chilli powder, 1 teaspoon of salt and 1 teaspoon of pepper. Just mix everything first. Now gradually pour some water to make a nice batter. We don't want the batter to be too runny or too thick. It should be just right for it to coat the cauliflowerets. The cauliflowerets have cooled down completely. Now add it into the batter. Mix everything till the cauliflowerets are completely coated with the batter. So if you feel the batter is less or the flour is not sufficient, you can just add a little bit extra to get the right consistency. So you can see the florets are coated nicely with the batter. Take a pan, pour enough oil for deep frying. Now I'm deep frying the cauliflowerets in the pan because that way they will not stick to each other and you'll get it beautifully. Deep fry the cauliflowerets in batches. Once they've turned to a nice golden brown color, remove them from the oil and keep it aside. Fry all the pieces in this manner. Take a nice wide kadai or a wok, add about 3 teaspoons of oil. So we are making this delicious honey garlic cauliflower. So I'm going to be adding a lot of garlic. This is about 2 tablespoons. Next add 1 large onion finely chopped. Saute the onions and garlic for about 2 minutes. Next add 1 teaspoon of salt, 1 teaspoon of chilli powder, 1 teaspoon pepper. To make it a little more spicier, I'm just adding another teaspoon of chilli flakes. Mix everything well. Keeping the flame on low, add 2 teaspoons of soya sauce, 2 teaspoons of vinegar and about 3 tablespoons of tomato ketchup. Just add a little bit of water and mix everything well. So I'm just going to make a corn flour slurry. I've taken one teaspoon of corn flour, pour enough water and mix it well. The corn flour is completely dissolved. Pour the corn flour slurry and mix it well. So now that our sauce is ready, I'm going to add the cauliflowerets. Make sure the cauliflowerets are nicely coated with the sauce. You can see how beautifully the cauliflowerets are coated. Look at that, it looks gorgeous. Turn off the stove. Finally, I'm going to add about 2 tablespoons of honey. Now you can adjust the sweetness according to your taste. If you'd like it a little sweet, you can add a little extra honey. So next, I'm going to add some spring onions. It's going to give a nice crunch. Mix everything well. The honey garlic cauliflower is ready to be served. It looks absolutely amazing. It's best when you serve it nice and hot. Makes for a wonderful starter. You can make for get togethers or parties or some nice evening dinners. I have made several recipes ranging from snacks to main course using cauliflower and you can check out those links in the description. There you go, the honey garlic cauliflower tastes great and you can enjoy it as is. 
It's a wonderful starter that you can make for get-togethers or parties. You can serve it as is or enjoy it with some nice fried rice by the side. To try the recipe, enjoy and let me know how it turned out for you guys in the comment section below. So for more exciting and wonderful recipes, subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell icon to get your notifications. The second edition of our home cooking book is now available on our website 21frames.in. I'll give you the link in the description. You can go and check it out. The book is currently available only in India for now. So you can place your orders on 21frames.in.